In this video, we'll learn to interpret percentage and percentage change as decimals and fractions. So again, percent means out of 100. So 1% is going to be 1 out of 100. And that's the fraction for it. As a decimal, we'll write that as 0 0.01. It's like one pence in a pound, and you know that we write a pence like this. So that can help you remember. 2% is double the 1%, and that is 2 out of 100, which we also write as 0 0.02. Again, 3% is going to be 3 times that, 4% is 4 times that, and 5% is 5 times the 1%. That is 5 out of 100. But how many 5s do we have in 100? It's 20 of them. As you can see so we can write this as 1 20th as well and that would be 0 0.05 like five pence what about 10 percent that is the same as saying 10 out of 100 and it's also the same as saying one-tenth because there are ten lots of ten in 100. So if we divide an amount by ten, it's going to give us 10% of it. And we can write this as 0 0.10 or 0 0.1. It means the same thing. So 10% is double the 5%. 20% is double the 10%. So it's 20 out of 100. So 20 here. How many lots of 20 do we have overall in 100? As you can see, it's five lots of them. So... That is one fifth, and write this as zero point two zero or just zero point two. Thirty percent is going to be three times this. So it's thirty out of one hundred. And it's also 3 out of 10. So 3 columns out of 10. And that is 0 0.3 or 0.30 as a decimal. 40%, as you can see, is 4 out of 10. And we can write it as 0 0.4 as a decimal. 50%. is five times the ten percent it's 50 out of 100 it's also one half so there is two parts we're taking one of them and that is 0 0.5 or 0 0.50 as a decimal 60 percent as you can see Going to be six out of ten. Seventy percent is going to be seven out of ten. Seventy out of one hundred. Eighty percent is going to be eight out of ten, or eighty out of one hundred. Ninety percent is going to be nine out of ten. One hundred percent. 
going to be the whole thing. It's 100 out of 100 and that is just one. 25% which we can split in different ways but I'm going to show it as a quarter. So there we have 25%, which is 25 out of 100, which is a quarter, which is 0 0.25. And 75% is going to be 75 out of 100, which is 3 quarters, and we write as 0 0.75. So if I add five more of these in here, that'll be 5% extra. And in total, this is going to be 105%. So 105% is the same as saying 100% plus 5%. So it's 105 out of 100. And if you divide 105 by 100, it gives you 1.05. So it's the same as having a pound and five pence on top. It's the same as increasing the whole amount by 5%. So having 100% and the 5% as well on top of the 100. 110% is going to be 110% and 10 additional on top. So when you have percentage increase, so a price increases by 10%, overall you're having 110% of the original price and if we take away let's say five percent from the 100 then we're left with 95 percent so there has been a five percent discount and we're left with 95 out of 100 which is 0 0.95 as a decimal or 95 out of 100 as a percentage or 95 out of 100 as a fraction 95 hundredths.